Hello everyone. Welcome to aptitude jab. This is uh, a caselet. It says that each day of uh, of a five day work week, Monday to Friday, Renu parks for the entire day in exactly one of the three parking lots X Y Z. One of these costs rupees hundred. Second cost rupees one twenty, and the third cost rupees one fifty. She parks in each of the three lots at least once during her work week. Now certain conditions are given to us. On Thursday, she parks in the one fifty rupees lot. Lot X costs more than lot Z. Okay, so uh, we can have one fifty, one twenty. We can have one fifty hundred and one twenty hundred. The lot Renu parks in on Wednesday costs more than the one she parks on Friday. She parks in lot Z on more days of the work week than she parks in lot X. So let us make this framework like this: Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. On Thursday, she parks in the one fifty rupees lot. This costs more than this. Now X costs more than Z, but Z is on more days. But she parks on more times than X. Okay. All right. Now uh, let us see the questions. We do not get a definite answer to this. We have questions on minimum, maximum, etc. So the first question says that what is the minimum cost she could pay during the week for parking her vehicle, right? So we need to minimize the cost. Let us assign one fifty ones, one twenty ones, and three hundred. Ah, uh, मतलब hundred three times. Is it possible to do? Let us check. Okay, so this value is greater than this. So let us put one twenty here and hundred here. It says that x is greater than z, but z occurs more times. So we will assume that this is z. Okay, so this this is satisfied. Thursday one fifty x cost more than z. Now x could be one twenty. X could be one fifty. That is also fine. Uh, she parks on Wednesday is higher than on Friday. That is also satisfied. She parks in lot Z on more days. So lot Z she parks on three days. So all conditions are being satisfied. So the minimum cost she can pay is five hundred and seventy. Now second question: What is the maximum cost she could pay during the week for parking her vehicle? Now Thursday is fixed as one fifty. Now, if we want to maximize this value, right? If we want to maximize this value, so if we take x is equal to one fifty and z is equal to one twenty, okay? Let us say that we assume this as the values: x one fifty, z one twenty, and y hundred. Okay? Can we put x three times? In order to maximize, we will see that. Whichever lot has the highest cost, we assign it the maximum number of times. Can we put three one one like this? If we try to put three one one like this, now what will happen is it is not possible because Z has to be more times. So we cannot put X is equal to one uh, fifty on three times. If we put it two times, then Z has to be more number of times. So we'll put it three and zero. That is also not possible because all number should be at least ones. Okay. Now if we put one time here, okay, and then we put two time here and two times here, that is a possibility. Okay. But can we have something that we increase in it in a better way? See, we cannot put x two times because if we put x two times, z should be three times. Okay. Now we can put only x maximum one time. We cannot have x two times because as soon as we put x two times, we have to put z three times. So we can have x one time. Z can be two or three times, okay. and y can be accordingly two or one time. Okay. Now we saw this condition that x we put one time, two time, two time. So instead of have y having two times, can we put y as one fifty and two times? Isn't it? If we put y one twenty one hundred one fifty two times, probably we can maximize this thing. If we put y two times, because we can have y two times, right? So we put y two times. Let us put x one time, 
and z two times doesn't it make sense that we have x one time uh, z is more number of times two times and y we maximize this 150 we if we have to maximize the total uh, rent she paid so we need to maximize the number of days she can park in the 150 rupees lot right so when we were assuming this to be x this cannot be z right uh, if we were assuming to be x we could uh, make it only one time we could not put x is equal to 2 right x2 is not possible so instead we assume that this is y y can be twice x is once and z is twice so this is 300 plus uh, 120 that is 420 plus 200 that is 620 so that is the maximum cost she could pay for the parking okay next question which of the following could be a complete and accurate list of which uh, lot renu parks in each day listed in order from monday through friday okay so again we will check that uh, the conditions so z is on more number of times okay here we see that x x is once z is uh, twice okay so this is possible here we have x once z is twice okay but if you see option b it says wednesday should be costlier than friday in this case it is z coming more than x in this case it is fine x is greater than z but z cannot be more than x so we can eliminate this option let us see the third option x two times z two times not possible because z has to be more number of times x two times z only once so that is also not possible so this is a possible list right so we have x once z twice this value is greater than this and we can assume that y is 150 possible okay so this is correct if lord z is the 120 rupees lord then on which one of the following days must renu park in lot y okay so let us find out when can she park in lot y <coughs> we are given that z is 120 rupees lot okay this is anyway x because it is 150 now this is greater than this so x is we saw that x cannot come two times because if x is twice z cannot be three times because z has to come more number of times now x is 150 that can happen only once x can come only once now this value is greater than this value so this means this cannot be x 150 okay this can only be 120 okay now this is given that this is lord z so this is z so this is 100 rupee lot that is y so we are confirmed that it is saying must right must that means it is a confirmation so on friday we are confirmed that she parks in lot y for other days we cannot determine for we can tell for wednesday thursday and friday <clears throat> we cannot tell for monday or tuesday so the answer is friday so this is the solution to the set and the answers to the questions